Well, here we are on location again. Of course, I'm on location wherever I am. Bathroom, kitchen, or whatever. But in any case, I didn't go see Kay this morning. Uh, I didn't sleep well last night. And I got a doctor's appointment this afternoon. And I'm going to have some hard questions for him. And he probably have a few for me. But in any case, I will go and see him. I had to have some rest. So, uh, but this area here where the Cascade is, you'll notice this was originally a hotel uh, built in about 1952, the year that I uh, bought my house in Lake Forest Park. The sidewalks are falling apart because they didn't put enough cement in there, in the, in the concrete. But in this area here, within one block are four taverns across the street, up at the end of the block, two taverns there and one uh, up the other corner, but you can get there in one block from going out on the alley side. The reason is, it looks like uh, the one tavern there was a theater. So when they built this uh, hotel, brand new, it was supposedly the premier hotel in Tacoma, of course, all these other outfits wanted to hang on it and uh, do their thing. So we still have four taverns, and this uh, one tavern is a very high scene, so it obviously was a theater at one time. But uh, so I would suggest, though, if you're looking for a, a uh, assisted living place, you want one with a bunch of beer next to you, this is the place. This is a premier place, but if you're looking for assisted living, put on the bottom of your list these big, huge corporations with headquarters back east somewhere with hundreds of uh, assisted living places. They, uh, they cut back. The, the bottom line, of course, is money, profits, and as a result, uh, care can suffer greatly. There's been some real scandals regarding uh, these corporations. So in any way, f make first choice Cascade and or others like it because the owner is right. You know, he's hands on and he's interested in the people that they been taken care of. So uh, keep that in mind if you're looking for assisted living.